Hello and welcome to another special video review and today we've got the part 3 of the Wei Yang uh, Computron or not Computron <laughs> and yeah uh, part 1 was Scattershot, part 2 was Lightspeed and today let's check out the bike which is uh, Afterburner so we've got the instructions right here and Afterburner is one of my favorite, pretty much my favorite of the lot. Uh, with light speed, uh, afterburn is uh, afterburner is pretty much uh, my favorite of the lot. So yeah, we've got instructions right here. The blue bike really reminds me of RC in the Prime series. But uh, yeah, instructions. Seriously, they're bad. I I had problem transforming him. I checked the instruction, and it only confused me even more. So. Seriously, don't don't use the instruction for live afterburner. Uh, just watch my video. <laughs> I got the transformation right now, all nailed up. But this, uh, the instructions right here, bad, 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 really confusing. So, afterburner, he is really cool. I'm pretty sure I've seen this sort of helmet in a video game somewhere. I'm not sure, but yeah, I really love the head. The head is on a ball joint, so uh, I can uh, move forward back forward back like this can rotate left and right look up look down so yeah really nice head sculpt arms uh can rotate like this uh does have a little bit of butterfly outgoing but it's more for transformation we have a swivel of the upper arm the elbow bends less than 90 degree and the wrist does rotate which is cool uh, nothing at the waist. We do have a leg that does the split. Do have ratchety front movement like this. No ratchet like this, but uh, no ratchet here either. And we do have a swivel of the upper leg. The knee does bend a little bit less than 90 degrees, but also can go forward. So if you want to break your leg, yeah. We do have the foot that goes out like this. Doesn't go in and does flip down up. And yeah, that's pretty much it. Uh, he's really cool. We do have some nice paint details with the spring or suspension right here. Uh, the rims, even the boats on the wheels. You have some uh, screws, I guess. <laughs> you have some more details right here. The visor is uh, metallic. So yeah, really nice looking bot, really. And yeah, if we can do a comparison again with the yeah, Onslaught, which is my go-to figure right now. So Onslaught is a leader size, a uh, Voyager size, and you can see he is a little bit smaller, but uh, yeah, he's bulkier. <laughs> I mean, Afterburn is wider, I guess, but yeah. Anyway, and we have just a deluxe figure, so we've got uh, Swindle, so yeah, much smaller. No, I don't have the uh, combining uh, Combiner Wars, a Computron, unfortunately, so we'll just have to go with Brodicus. All right, so that's pretty much it. Um, he does have diecast. The leg part right here, the uh, outside here, is all diecast, which is cool. It, I think it's pretty much the only thing diecast on him, so yeah. And uh, all right, so transformation, like it's a really nice original transformation. I really like it. First off, bring unpeg this from the back so this pegs inside of the connector right here so bring it down bring this out uh, bring this connector part up straight like this and then you want to uh, open up this panel it's kind of hard but uh... all right like this so we just open this up and it opens on this joint, which was how I uh, figured out to open it, and the transformation just did not work, and the instructions didn't help. But you have a second uh, thing, that, a second panel to go down. So you have this and this. Now the transformation will work. So now that you have this, rotate the whole thing in like this, and then close the panel completely again. Like this, like this. Turn it around. So you have the head, now the head separates in two and flips down like this. Really interesting. And here's another part of the instra that I find is, uh, intriguing. So rotate the arms like this, so that the uh, metal part all falls up and close them in. And now the fun thing is, uh, this muffler goes down 
like this, but it will get stuck here. So it will get stuck somewhere here. And you have to rotate the arms up like this, close the muffler in and keep rotating the arm so that they go over the uh, muffler and peg it in. So uh, like this, close the muffler in and then keep rotating. And as you keep rotating, there's this mushroom peg that will connect onto the muffler and peg in. So now you have this set up. Now you can close these in and peg them in like this. Take the back panel right here and it's on a joint right here. So you want to bring it forward and you want to connect these right here. Voila. So these sort of muffler goes inside of here and these pegs on the arms like this. So then you have uh, this setup, a girl walk mode. <laughs> so uh, bringing the legs down but on the knees. So make the legs straight like this, but bend them at the knees like this. As you bend them at the knees, there's a peg right here that will go inside right, right here, that hole. So bring it up and it will connect like this. Bring it up, connect it like this. Now peg the wheels together like this. There's a peg in the middle right here. And take this panel, flip it down, flip it down like this. Now you have the feet that you have to bring forward like this and bring this, the toes like this. So bring the foot down like this. Flip the toes in and down. And now you're gonna bring this panel over this part. And there's a peg hole right here that the toe, uh, the, uh, the the feet right here is gonna peg in. So bring it over and peg it in. I think it's in. So bring it the other side too. Bring it up and peg it in, voila. It goes in real close and you have the Afterburn in bike mode and yeah, really cool. It does roll. We have massive wheels that are really nice I have a tiny wheel in front. I really don't like the tiny wheel, but yeah, it works Even stand because he's so uh, wide Ooh, The back looks like a bike from uh, Tron the front uh, the wheel doesn't look too good, but it works <laughs> Do have a nice metallic uh, cockpit view we do have metallic here metallic at the spring the bolts on the um, the wheels and yeah looks really damn cool I really dig this like I said he's one of my favorite we do have some nice van that doubles as the toes the feet just on peg but yeah nice details I really live I love this guy but uh yeah that's pretty much it for uh, afterburn really cool bike so, yeah, that's pretty much it for part three of the Wei Yang Computron combiner. So, uh, come back for uh, both Nose Cone and uh, Strafe. So, we'll see which one I do next. So, like, subscribe, don't miss any of my videos. Still have a ton more to come. So, thank you for watching and see you next time.